Hope you got your balls ready, cause it's time to catch some more Pokemon. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. It's Frisky Two Times here, and I'm about to break it down, let you know what's going on with the mobile gaming side of the news. So first and foremost, if you haven't already seen it yet, yesterday they released a, a plethora of Pokemon news. And with all that, be it you sleeping with your Pokemon, they're waking you up, you catching stuff while you sleep, all this and that, and you got your Pokemon home, you go home to your Pokemon, you sleep with it. Besides all of that, the key news was we're getting another good mobile game. Yep, that's right, Pokemon Masters. So from the short, short trailer that we did get, we've seen a lot that we can get out of this trailer. So from the beginning, let's just break it down, DNA. Who are they? What has DNA done for you? Besides the breaking block chemicals of the whole humans and animals and everything else in life, DNA is a company that is of course based off over in the Asian territories. And what they have done is, they've done several mobile games in the past. One of the most popular that I remember playing was Rise of Bahamut. I know I pronounced that bad, but I'm Southern, it happens. So, if you've ever played that game, it was a basically a card-based RPG style game, very in that time of era of you attack, I attack, you attack, you, you know, you create, you bring in several monsters together, you make a card. It was a card game, but it was fun, it had dungeons. It was cool, I really enjoyed it, but I didn't know DNA was involved in that. And now, looking back at their history, they were involved in tons of games, some Final Fantasy mobile games, and a lot of other ones. But knowing that they are going the route of going to another actual company, a third party company, you could say, to create a mobile game, is pretty interesting, because they did that with Pokemon Go. So, it looked like they're getting outside help for people that already know the marketplace that they want. Which is great because they already have it cornered here in America without people really thinking about it. They've been one of the main, you know, you got your Nintendos, your Segas, your Sonys. They have been one of the main third big party people out of the three big, you know, gaming setups. They've been the only one that's on the mobile title with great titles. They've had Pokemon Go. You had the Mitobi plays, and then you got the Animal Crossing. There's so many games that they've been coming out with, and not only just this, they have announced also that, I don't know if you heard it yet, they got a Mario Kart coming to mobile. Yes, it's a Mario Kart. Yes, it's riddled with tons of microtransactions. That's a whole nother video that we will be discussing later. But they are doing this really catching that mobile games bring in tons of money. Most people think of mobiles not being a real powerhouse, but they are a money house or a money phone. So speaking back on phone, monies, and houses, let's get back to these Pokemans and I'm gonna show you what's been going on. So if you can see here in this picture, you'll notice that they are in a 3v3 type of setup. It looks like you can fight tons of people from, uh, as I said, around the region that you've met before, that you've seen in different games, which is gonna be super cool. As they saw in this picture that you got Misty and Brock by your side, and it looks like that from the get-go, you'll be able to create your own character, which is something that people have been doing in the game series for a while now. So knowing that alone, we'll be able to create our character, make them look any type of way, make them look like us, which is gonna be fun because we all like creating our own character. And then on top of that, it looks like they're starting off with a Pikachu. So either we get to select the original three, including Pikachu, or we just get a Pikachu right off the back, or maybe even an Eevee if it coordinates with the actual other games coming out. So we'll see how that goes. But looking more into the photo, you'll see that you have a move Thundershock, and then you have Potion, and then you have your Z move, which is in the middle, and you got two empty blanks. I'm thinking those empty spots, well, you will have another move, and then down below, you'll probably have another type of potion you can use, maybe like an Either or Max Heal, Max Repel, 
rope, escape rope, some type, something else. You have another item slot, and I think the other one will be an attack slot because the other actual have the same thing. They have their Z moves, they have their two other buttons right here, and two empty spots right here. And then you'll see that there is a, at the bottom of the page, if you then look at the picture, you probably saw all the Pokemans, you saw them fighting, you was like, oh, what's going on? What is this? You have like a charge bar system. It looks like maybe you get a good gauge of six. So with most things, when it comes with like a stamina gauge like that, you either take turns hitting or take turns fighting. Or if you take a look right above that thunder shot, it shows one little blue button. Maybe that takes away each move probably costs a certain meter amount of, you know, out of that whole stamina gauge that you have and it will cause the attack. So maybe your Thundershock has one, you can get Thunderbolt later, but that might be three. And then vice versa, everybody has their own thing, but you only have so much to work with. So it kind of gives you a play on who should I attack, what should I attack with, how should I attack? We'll see how it goes. But from the trailer, we just got the fact that it's gonna look beautiful. It's gonna look like your 3DS games because mobile phones, they have a lot of power in them. On the iOS and on the Android side, they're both are really good powerhouses. So when we see everything all laid out in front of us, it looks like Pokemon and Nintendo in general are going to take the market on the mobile gaming coming at the end of this year. This is dropping in 2019. We also know that the other Pokemon games are dropping in 2019. And we also know that Mario Kart is dropping at the end of 2019. They are already actually beta testing the Mario Kart game on the mobile side. So. Just be ready. Have your phone upgraded with all your plans with AT&T, T-Mobile, Xfinity, everybody. Whoever you have, make sure your phone can run this. Make sure you got plenty of memory because it's about to go down and it's about to be a blast. Make sure you choose which balls you're going to throw to catch the Pokemon that you need. We're going to see how everything else coordinates with it. You got your weaknesses, you got your fairies, you got everything that's in your main title Pokemon games. It's going to be on this mobile master series, it looks like. Kind of like how back in the series where you know you could use your phone to call up somebody to fight. Now it looks like you're going to be able to go call them up and probably just go fight them right off the bat. Who knows if this is going to be PvP or if it's going to be littered with actual microtransactions as well. We don't know any of that yet, but I can assume that there probably will be a PvP aspect of it and a friendship. You can battle with two of your friends to fight other people. Maybe some type of, you know, team systems, Pokemon battle, maybe like Team Rocket, things like that. I can definitely see them taking advantage of. And with so much, so many years of Pokemon gaming to go off of, I can see this actually riding off into the future, hitting the nostalgia point of all us older people and getting all the younger people who have cell phones and then the parents caught in between that just gonna, you know, let them run wild with the Pokemons and their credit cards and just eat this right up. But yes, so far, that's all we got. That's all we know. Besides that and the fact that yes, the original creator, one of the original creators are working on this title as well with DNA. So it's in actual good hands. But when we get more notice, we're going to get some more news on it. I want to say they said next month. So be ready, and I will have more about Pokemon Masters. Are you a master? Are you ready for your balls to be mastering them Pokemons? Let me know down in the comments on what you are looking forward to and who you want to use in your team, in your lineup. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, share, subscribe and give me your favorite Pokemon of all time down below because mine is number one, Bulbasaur. I'll be coming up with more news, mobile gaming news for everything that you need to know about occupying your free time when you're on the bus, on a plane, driving in the car with your girl, with your guy, with them or with they. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to always, always stay frisky. I like the skills. They pay the bills They act like you fuck with them They don't know